everyone! It's a busy day here at the library. We're getting ready for our big summer fun day. There will be lots of games, food, and of course, lots of stories. Oh my! Coach Cody, let me help you with that. <laughs> oh. Thanks, Miss Jenny. You're welcome. Oh, goodness. That was a big load. It was. <laughs> I want to make sure I've got everything we need for Summer Fun Day. I don't think you've forgotten anything. <laughs> Thank you for planning so many great games for the kids. It will be lots of fun. <laughs> but, can I rest here for just a minute? Carrying all of this equipment has made me tired. <laughs> of course you can. You're a good friend, Coach Cody. <laughs> Thanks for all of your hard work. Why don't I tell you a Bible story while you rest? That sounds great. <laughs> this Bible story is about two friends named Paul and Philemon. One day, Paul wrote a letter to his friend. Let's hear what Paul wrote. I always thank my God when I mention you in my prayers. Paul prayed for his friend. Paul wrote that he had heard about Philemon's love for God and his people. He wrote, You have encouraged so many people. It makes me happy that you are doing work for God. A man named Onesimus was Paul's helper. Paul wrote that Onesimus had become like a son to him. I am sending Onesimus to you, Paul wrote. He has been a great help to me, and he will be a big help to you too. He is more than just a hard worker. Onesimus is a follower of Jesus. If you consider me a friend, welcome Onesimus as you would me. Paul wanted Philemon to treat Onesimus like a brother. Paul wrote, If Onesimus owes you any money, charge it to me. I will repay all of it. Paul ended his letter and said that he hoped to visit soon. Paul asked Philemon to get a room ready for him. Paul wrote a letter to Philemon, sent him a helper, and told Philemon what he should do. I think Paul and Philemon must have been very good friends. <laughs> kind of like us, Miss Jenny. <laughs> we work together and we help each other. Hey, you're right. Coach Cody, I know another friend who loves and helps us. I'm thinking of an extra special friend. Can you guess who? Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> That's right! Jesus loves you so much. He is the best friend ever. Jesus came to earth and did the things that God wanted him to do. We can know what God wants us to do, too. We can read the Bible and hear Bible stories. The words in the Bible are special because they are God's words. The Bible teaches us about Jesus and helps us know what is right. <laughs> Thanks for the Bible story, Miss Jenny. But I better get busy. I have a lot of games to set up for Summer Fun Day. Let me help you. I can't wait for Summer Fun Day. It will be so much <laughs> fun! <laughs> See you soon!